This is Beautiful People Tampa Bay, sponsored by Advent Health. In today's Beautiful People, we are getting a glimpse of what service looks like through the eyes of a Tampa man. Leon Page served his country in the Army, his county as a deputy, and now his community as a volunteer. Take a look. I was active duty for 26 years, and I chose to stay in the reserve program another four years. Leon Page looks back fondly at the years he served as a Hillsborough County deputy, where he did just about everything. I started out in, in patrol, uh, then we created, uh, uh, the office created what was uh, called street crimes, and uh, I was selected for that. Uh, I was on a DUI squad at one point. Um, I went to narcotics where I spent a majority of my time, and I eventually got promoted to supervisor. His main area of patrol was near the University of South Florida. It's an area many people called Suitcase City. We had to come over here and patrol this area because there was no office here. The office was built, and this was like um, wild, wild west. I mean, the crime was rampant. Now in retirement, he has a soft spot for what's now called the University Area Community Development District. He even sits on the board of an organization helping to revive that area. Now, if you can look around, uh, we're building a park, splash pad, we got playground behind, we got a nice facility right beside us, and all around us, that's uh, continue to go on. So you're going to see a lot more of that type of activity in the area soon. He says the biggest change, more people now own homes in this community, and that makes a difference. But if you have ownership in an area, you're going to be responsible for it and so forth. So uh, we have a, a, a lot of energy invested into trying to make sure people become a part of the area, even for the home ownership or long-term residency. Leon is also a proud father and grandfather, and he looks forward to helping others find those brighter days. Well, I like to see people when they don't have the burden of um, just paying rent, and buying groceries and things like that, you know, and if there's something that we can do to assist in that, then, then I'm going to be doing that kind of thing. Obviously a staple in the community there. Now this was Suitcase City, he said, yeah. a really transient area. Yeah, I mean, the university area, you're thinking of a lot of students, they come in and out. Nobody really lived there long term. It was really vulnerable to crime when he was patrolling it, but he has so much seen it change. And now they're really hoping to get rid of that old nickname of Suitcase City yeah. because it really is being redeveloped into a nice diverse area where people can live, work, right. and play. Yeah, it's really changed over the last decade. So. Yeah, absolutely. Well, he's making quite an impact. 